When y'all say y'all dress and half naked in public and it's not for the male gaze, then who is it for? Are y'all lesbian? Wait a minute. <sighs> that nigga got a point. See, we always got smoke for the dusty man. We never talk about dusty women. <laughs> going on everybody welcome back to another one hit that like subscribe tickle that notification bell that will let you know when i upload content you know what we're gonna do yep roll that clip he is absolutely correct i'm gonna tell you where the confusion be coming in at a lot of these men who dusty to be pulling these women and you'd be so confused because you'd be like oh my gosh she could have did so much better no she couldn't damn you're good because she dusty too She's just a shapeshifter. Yep. Right? She can just dress hers up a little bit better than him. Like, you can look at him and know straight off he a pookie. Like, you can look at him and know straight off he a pookie. But her, it's going to take a little bit more work because she be dressing it up. She actually is attractive, got a nice body. So those things throw you off, and you don't realize that internally she's dusty. Right? She just as messed up mentally as he is. You just get confused because she looks better on the outside. And see, this is how men get tricked all the time with dusty women. Because she looks good on the outside, you don't realize she's dusty on the inside. Ladies, all two and a half of y'all watching. A lot of y'all. You look dusty. And you disguise it with nice outfits, nice perfume. But at the end of the day, we always talk about men. But we never talk about the women. We never talk about the women that lay up with dusty guns. We always talk about men need to do better. Men need to do better. Men need to do this. He ain't lying. What about the women? What about the women that sleep with men with multiple kids? I'll be the victim all your life. What about the women that give a man a child even though he has a criminal record. What about the women that decide I'm gonna date a guy that's in jail? What about the women that know this guy is bad, but she goes through it anyway? You brought this on yourself. Fellas, don't ever let a woman give you the gaslight and say, well, I didn't know. I didn't understand. I was too young. He fooled me. Those are all it's bullshit. Women understand what type of men are out there and what time those types of men are on. If you know me well enough and you've been a subscriber to this channel for a long time, you know here that we talk about why. Why are there so many dusty women out here? Why don't women want to take accountability? Why don't women want to take responsibility. I'm gonna let this sister explain. And ew, I can't believe he cheated on me with her. Ew, I can't believe he's dealing with a woman who doesn't look as good as me or make as much money as me. I think we need to realize that the looks is not about the looks. Maybe that man started dealing with that woman because she treated him with some respect. He treated him with some respect. Maybe he started dealing with that woman because she had admiration for him and she had self-control and she stayed in her feminine energy. Us as women, not all of us, we are in extreme competition with each other. And half the things that we do to ourselves and, and get ourselves all done up, the men really, really don't care about as evidence why they deal with women who are maybe not as attractive and maybe not as dominant. So before we focus so much on the outward appearance, we really need to start working on our inward self because clearly you can be as pretty as you want to be, but if you're not respectful and kind and sweet, of course, naturally a man is going to gravitate to a person who makes them feel like a leader and a king. Now I can say maybe everybody isn't deserving of that, but if you are constantly seeing yourself, finding yourself um, dealing with men who go less than you or lower than you, it really might be your character that's making you the problem. 
Be the woman you would want your son to date or your father or your brother. Don't be so problematic and think just because you're pretty that anybody's going to deal with you because that's really, that's really not the case. And see, she hit it on the head. She broke it down very clear. A lot of you women are dusty because your attitudes you stink. Your personality is garbage. The only thing you bring to the table is your butt and your boobs. God damn! God damn! God damn! God damn! God damn! You have character flaws, you have trauma, you have a whole bunch of brokenness. So you, you fall back on your looks because that's what gets you the men in your DMs. He ain't lying. But see, here's the caveat. The men that are lusting after you over your looks are not the type of men that you would want to bring home to your parents if you had both of them. You're a victim. Mm. Here we go, CSI. And I've noticed the pattern is a lot of these women that focus solely on looks have nothing else to offer a man. They can't cook. They can't clean. They can't take care of a home. And when we talk about what women are supposed to do with men, we're just talking about what women are going to do whether they live with a man or not. You're going to clean, you're going to cook, you're going to take care of a home, whether you have a man or not. It's pretty much the same thing. And see, a lot of women are dusty because they don't have anything to offer. They don't do anything. You don't have conversation skills. You don't have a good personality. You don't make a man feel needed or wanted. It's all about you. Because you're greedy, schemy, and selfish. You know something? You're right. You know what a man can do for you versus what you can do for a man. Your job as a woman, and I know some of you didn't have fathers growing up, so let me give you some advice. If you didn't have a father growing up, your main priority is to find a male role model who can teach you how to be a woman. Because this is what men across the board like. They want a woman who can make them feel needed and wanted, appreciated, and will treat them like a king, just like the sister say. And a lot of you are just dusty. And you're dusty because your mom failed you, your family failed you, your friends failed you, life failed you. And instead of sitting down wallowing in self-pity because life failed you, you need to understand that you're grown, so you're now held accountable for your own actions. You can't blame your mom, your dad, your Lack of a parent. Like something needs to change. And a lot of dusty women would rather be dusty because they don't want better because they don't feel that they need to do better. Let me tell you something. So they'll continue the same cycle over and over again. Ladies, if you realize that you're attracting the same type of man over and over and over again. Maybe you want to sit back and say, well, is it me? Do I need to change? Because if you're doing the same thing over and over again, but you're expecting a different result, that's the definition of insanity. And you're wasting your time. Anyway, y'all, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget, hit that like, subscribe, tickle that notification bell. That will let you know whenever I upload content. And until the next one, peace. You look dusty.